Hey everyone, Chris Kirsten here with the Sabre Institute. We're about to head over to the uh, final climate march happening over at the Eiffel Tower. Uh, it's been an amazing couple of weeks here in Paris. Uh, a few key things have happened that uh, have never really happened before, these COP climate talks, uh, these UN sanctioned uh, uh, climate discussions, that's really exciting. Number one, it looks like uh, things are leaning towards, there's gonna be uh, some, um, um, collaboration to really immensely cut fossil fuel usage, uh, which is long overdue, uh, and maybe go so far as to eliminate entirely over the next uh, generation of people. Uh, something that, that absolutely has to happen uh, and that we can't shirk away from. So to have governments finally acknowledge this and start putting action plans in place is incredible. Uh, the second, which may be even more exciting, uh, is the attention to soil. Uh, we have a huge legacy load of carbon in our atmosphere already. Uh, if we stopped fossil fuel emissions today, uh, it would not stop warming. And we have to do something with that legacy load. And to see governments finally acknowledge that the only proper place to put that uh, is back into our landscapes, back into healthy soil, uh, where in soil, uh, carbon is uh, its a foundation of organic matter. And it is a source of fertility uh, and uh, holds water and infiltrates water back into ground reservoirs. Um, and is just a, a source of abundance to feed people and solve all, all sorts of problems. Uh, and in the atmosphere, it's a source of warming where it causes all all sorts of planetary degradation. So to see that acknowledged and to see action plans start to come together, uh, it's a really, really exciting time. So uh, let's go check out the march and see what's going on uh, and see all the excitement and energy about everything that's happening. Yeah.